Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your Mozilla Firefox web browser is not opening or displaying web pages properly. So this should be a pretty quick tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. So if you find that this problem is only affecting the Firefox web browser, this tutorial will probably not apply to you. But if you notice that Firefox along with other web browsers are experiencing this similar issue, then this tutorial is more than likely for you. And no matter what we do in this video, it shouldn't really harm anything either way. So there's really no harm in trying. So with that said, let's jump right into it. And we're going to start by opening up the star menu. And you want to type in command prompt. Best man should say command prompt. You want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control window, you want to select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, you want to type in IP config space forward slash flush DNS. Keep in mind there's a space in between the IP config and the forward slash here, and there is no space in between the forward slash and the flush DNS. Flush DNS is all one word here. And then you want to hit enter. If you typed it incorrectly, it should say successfully flushed the DNS resolver cache. Now you want to type in NET. SH space Winsock, so W I N S O C K space reset, so N E T S H space Winsock space reset, and then once you have it exactly how it appears on my screen, you want to hit enter on your keyboard. Should hopefully say it successfully reset the Winsock catalog. You must restart the computer in order to complete the reset, and then I would recommend listening to that advice. Close out of anything you have open, restart your computer and hopefully your problem has been resolved. So as always, thank you for watching this tutorial. I do hope it helped you out, and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.